Flag detail. Post. Flag detail. Forward. March. Flag detail. Mark time. March. Flag detail. Halt. Flag detail. About. Base. I am the flag of the United States. My name is Old Glory. I fly atop the world's tallest buildings. I stand watch in America's halls of justice. I fly majestically over great institutions of learning. I stand guard with the greatest military power of the world. Look up and see me. I stand for peace, honor, truth, and justice. I stand for freedom. I am confident. I am arrogant. I am proud. When I am flown with my fellow banners, my head is a little higher, my colors a little truer. I bow to no one. I am recognized all over the world. I am worshiped. I am saluted. I am respected. I am revered. I am loved and I am feared. I have fought in every battle of every war for more than 200 years. Gettysburg, Shiloh, Appomattox, San Juan Hill, the trenches of France, the Argonne Forest, Anzio, Rome, the beaches of Normandy, the jungles of Guam, Okinawa, Japan, Korea, Vietnam, the Persian Gulf, and a score of places long forgotten by all but those who were there with me, I was there. I led my sailors and marines. I followed them. I watched over them. They loved me. I was on a small hill in Iwo Jima. I was dirty, battle-worn and tired. But shipmates cheered me and I was proud. I have been soiled, burned, torn, and trampled on in the streets of my own country. And when it is by those whom I have served in battle, it hurts. But I shall overcome, for I am strong. I have slipped the bonds of earth, and from my vantage point on the moon, I stand watch over the uncharted new frontiers of space. I have been a silent witness to all of America's finest hours, but my finest hours come when I am torn into strips to be used as bandages for my wounded comrades on the field of battle, when I fly half-mast to honor my sailors and marines, and when I lie in the trembling arms of a grieving mother at the graveside of her fallen son or daughter. I am proud, my name is Old Glory. Long may I wave. Dear God, long may I wave. Retire the flag detail. Flag detail, about, face. Flag detail, forward, march. Commander John LaRue will now read the watch. Ah, mates, for many years this man stood the watch. While some of us lay about our bunks at night, this sailor stood the watch. While we were attending schools, this sailor stood the watch. And yes, even before many of us were born, this sailor stood the watch. As our families watched storm clouds of war brewing on the horizons of history, he stood the watch. This sailor looked ashore and saw his family often needing his guidance, but he knew he must stay because he had the watch. For over 20 years, Ron S. Slinger has stood the watch so that we and our fellow countrymen could sleep soundly in safety knowing that a sailor stood the watch. Today we are here to say, Captain Esslinger, the watch stands relieved. Relieved, of, relieved by those of us you have led, guided, and trained. Captain Esslinger, you stand relieved. We have the watch. Boats and stand by to pipe the side. Shipmate going ashore. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the benediction and remain standing while Captain Esslinger is piped over the side. Let us pray together. Lord of the seasons of life, we have honored Captain Ron Essinger, who has served with us and will now hang up his uniform to begin yet another life season. His departure makes us grateful and reflective. Grateful for his life in which he has been our teacher, 
our encourager, our sustainer in good times and bad. Reflective of his work and the high calling of the grateful nation whom he serves and the cause of peace that he has upheld through strength and courage. Now grant him and his family fair winds and following seas. In the precious name of Jesus we ask. Amen. Side boys, post. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand by for the departure of the official party. Captain Michael R. Esslinger, Nurse Corps, United States Navy, retired, departing. <laughs>